A metaphor Meg likes to use when teaching sound is to relate mixing audio to baking a cake. Your project file is the recipe. It tells you which ingredients and how much of each ingredient to use, what order to add them in, and how to combine them. Your source files are the ingredients. Let's think of the egg as representing the voice and flour representing the guitar. Your final audio file is the cake, in this case, a pancake. Once you've mixed egg and flour together, you can't separate out the ingredients. In audio, we call this bouncing or exporting. Once you've exported the combined audio of the voice and guitar, it is impossible to separate them again. Our brains are excellent at this sort of signal separation, but we haven't developed computational algorithms to perform this isolation. Just like layers in Photoshop or GIMP, once you combine tracks and export, there is no way to get the original files back. The privilege of using a digital audio workstation, or DAW, is non-destructive editing. So be sure to keep your project files in a safe place after you've exported your audio files, just in case you'd like to revise your project at a later date. With your DAW, you can have both your pancake and the individual ingredients.